now finally have our friend Sam Chen here hey with guys. us. Oh wow, I'm yeah. very tall. Uh, yeah. <laughs> okay, <laughs> so you <laughs> can do this <laughs> because Sam is very very tall. Uh, yeah, there he's in focus. Um, no surpanish. We're actually um, doing non-competitive decks, so the you less guys. the less meta deck, the better. And yeah, here's Sam Chen. He's staying over the week. So he'll be piloting the Gyarados deck that I prepared for today, but he's cool. going in blind. He has no idea what the deck does. He has no idea what Gyarados we're even using, <laughs> right? <laughs> um, so Sir right. Pandage, if you want to send me the challenge, please do so. And yeah, um, how are you doing, Sam? Welcome. Thank you yeah. for joining us. No, I'm glad to be here. I'm doing well. <laughs> I'm here for the Mexico City special event and next weekend's Cancun special event so hopefully i get points at one of these two events and, and lock up top 16 but uh sure, you can listen to the music as well. oh sure uh might not get nah who cares yeah 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 it's only music it's only music yeah <laughs> uh yes we actually manchester we have uh, i took sam chen to have uh tacos al pastor yesterday and i believe he enjoyed them i did enjoy them how was the spice though how's the salsa oh so I didn't really fully understand what all the spices were. And so I put the same amount of like the light spicy stuff with the, uh, so I, I tried all the spices and by the time we got to the fourth one, it was the habanero sauce. And I just put the same amount as I did every other, um, every other one of the spices that I had tried. And I ended up like crying and with, like <laughs> water running out of my nose, but it was still a good experience. Yeah, it was, it was a good, welcome to Mexico City. Um, I okay, so send yeah, I'm 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 sad I, I missed the seeking episode, but uh. <laughs> add me again, Sir Pandage. I didn't delete you on purpose. Uh, just yes, send, he did. Send, no, I did not. Yeah, he did. He told send me. Send me early. send me a friend request again, and then I'll I'll accept, and then you can send the challenge. <laughs> I need a I need a smaller chair because I'm like crouched over. If I stand okay, we'll switch. Audience, we'll switch. We'll switch. Yeah, we will switch. <laughs> right. So you can pilot the deck properly. <laughs> All right, perfect. I have no idea how the UI works on. Okay. On PC uh, I mean, all you need to okay, all we need to do is wait until um, Sir Pandage adds us. Uh, is that you, RK? Uh, is that you, Sir Pandage? Um, is Pablo from? Why is Sam in Mexico? There's a special event this weekend, um, tomorrow actually. And is Pablo from South America? No, I'm from North America. <laughs> okay, so send me a challenge, Sir Pandage, and we'll get started with this Gyarados deck. I mean, you get a hint of what's in the deck there. There's Water-type Pokemon in the Gyarados deck, there's Psychic, and there's Fairy-types as well. So it's... And there's more, there's a plus sign. And there's more, exactly. All right, so, so yeah, now just select the Gyarados, this. Okay. and then click Accept. There you God. go. I really hope this is the Mega. <laughs> We're not trying to discard all our Magic Harps. And yeah, man, just Sam will be in Cancun. He's staying the week, and then we're flying to Cancun. So you can invite those. You can treat him to the Swadero tacos if you really want. And yeah, Sam actually does not play PTCGO. Jesus, <laughs> why? <laughs> when why? you thought you thought the psychic type Pokemon was Lele, well, it's not. <laughs> it's actually why. Jinx. <laughs> uh, we're going second, right? Uh... Yeah. <laughs> Jesus. All right, we'll start the Jinx, I guess. I have no idea what else is in the deck, nor what Gyarados this is, so... Um. Don't cover your mouth. Oh, sorry. It's yeah. okay. Yeah, I'm not used to streaming. But, uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I would have started the Remoraid had I had more information, but I didn't want uh, this card to get end away. Yeah. So. And Henry, um, unless there were not enough interest to to play um from other people um then it would be fine for you to play again but um we've already played today so it's the rule is um each person gets to play once um every time i stream yeah and look you're up against a wolf fed alola nine tail tapu fini deck <laughs> oh I, now i now i hope this is not the mega because uh that tapu fini is going to destroy all the energies oh no supporter was a supporter? No, Sycamore was played. Yeah. So I don't play on PTCGO, so I'm not used to this interface. Um, I still don't know what Gyarados this is. <laughs> uh, so I think 
the safest thing is to go for the float stone to give myself flexibility. Uh, of the three supporters, I don't want a Sycamore. I don't want to lose the Aqua Patch just yet because I don't know what this is once again. <laughs> My opponent's hand's at four, so I don't want to give him a hand of six. So I think the most logical thing to do is to play the Cynthia. Yeah. So let's do that. Uh, thank Please. you, Pedro. <laughs> oh no, it's the rage. I don't even know what the magic harp does. Um, well, with the shining cell of you, that should. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, the, it's the rage or whatever. I don't know what yeah. the attack is. Uh, I will play the Brooklet Hill, even though it helps my opponent, um, just because I need to read what the magic harp does. <laughs> oh, it's the evolutions yeah. or generations? Generations yeah. one. Yeah. Uh, if I click this, will it automatically. Uh, you click, click it, it and then. Yeah, okay, how do I read this? Uh, well, I'll flip a coin. Can, yeah. Or no, for each GI. Yeah, okay, which Gyarados are we using? The GX. The GX, because it has um, so much HP, so you get hit, and then use Shining Celebi, which you are very uh, familiar with, thanks to Shock Lock. I, and <laughs> I still hate you, Pablo. If I right-click, does it show the text to the card? Uh, in this part, no, but... Okay, so what does this to, do? Uh, it deals 100, and if there's a Stadium in play, it discards it and deals 100 more, like Jeez. Primal Groden. That's insane, and the GX is discarding discard energy. It discards one energy from oh, each of your energy. opponent's Pokemon. Okay, so that's good. I'm gonna get the Magikarp. <laughs> oh my god. I can't believe we're doing this. Uh, uh, well, this Mr. Mime's gonna be very helpful because of Alolan GX, Alolan Ninetales. See, I, I GX covered all the bases. Attack. I covered all the bases. You did cover all the bases, uh, and I still hate you. Um, so what I'm going to do now is I'm actually going to play Field Blower. Uh, this deck is so bad that I think I need to try to prevent my opponent from being able to retreat. Um, so I select that and that. I want to keep the Brooklet Hill in play. My opponent already has their Vulpixes in play, so even if they get a third one, there's not much marginal harm. I, but I do need to get a second Magikarp next turn, so I'm going to discard the Floatstone and Choice Band. And Pablo, I think I'm going to... Do I bench the Celebi? Well, I have the Mr. Mime, so it's protected. I'm just afraid of a little Guzma action here that my opponent has. Uh, I'll bench I think it. it's fine. I'll yeah. bench it. Uh, it's all about being risky and having fun. And that is true. It's All right, I'm going to pass the turn. Yeah. These are non-meta decks, so... <coughs> like, and I also choose to not use things like uh, Lele and stuff like that to make it... Um, um, right, because there's a more Jinx in my active against, position. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so, so, I mean, we're trying to heal a lot of damage, right? Yeah. Jinx is good. Now, the one thing I didn't cover, however, is the non-GX Alolan Ninetales, so that might be an issue. You yeah. might end up having to hug the Alolan Ninetales with Auxiliary. Oh, uh, good. That's and just there exactly it is. what yep. I want. Oh, good. There it is. Fun. <laughs> this is... Uh, what is... Okay, well... Yeah. Is Hug the only... Yep, Hug is the only I thing think, we can do. Yep, I think Hug is the only out. Um, I think Hug <laughs> is the only out we have to the Alola. Oh, Nigel. boy. The issue is he also out-damages us. So that could be... Yeah, I don't think there's any way we can play around that. Hey, both the Jinx and the Octillery have Hug as, a, as an attack. So oh, that's true. That is... <laughs> Jinx has seeking synergy indeed. Uh, yeah, why is this not seeking? <laughs> well, this is really bad. Uh, I'm going to have to evolve his magic carp no matter what. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> we could flail without Gyarados, that Good. is true. You got it, Pablo. That's the strat. <laughs> Our hand is also quite bad, so I do want to attach some things to try to... I mean, we can Kuzma and then use yeah. artillery, right? That is, that is something we can do. I also think we attach the choice band here. I want to get rid of... Um, I want to make it as difficult as it is as possible for my opponent to do anything. Uh, let, me, let me try something here. I might... Yeah, I'm going to goose... Oh, I don't even know what to do. What is this, <laughs> I don't know what, what does to attack do. attack do? Waterfall? Uh, I mean, the energy has to go on the Gyarados. And we're just gonna have to hope that our opponent benches something else and we can take six prizes outside of the... Alright, so what do I Guzma here? I think I'm gonna go... Like, Alolan Vulpix is not a great target either. Yeah. Um, Guzma the Feeny and get my Gyarados shuffled back? That's honestly not horrible. Let me let me Brooklet Hill first to see what's in here. I could get a second Octillery because it's my primary attacker in this matchup. <laughs> How many waters do you play, Pablo? Seven? That's not horrible. Seven and four Aqua Patches, so we prize two of them. 
That's great. So I'm going to get the Breath Parade, because we have to <laughs> attack with Octillery. Uh, well, let's... Uh, this is going to suck, but I'm going to have to try to draw some cards to get out of this pickle. I'm going to Guzma, yeah, the Alolan Vulpix, one, with right? no energies, yeah. and I'm going to bring up my Gyarados in this situation. No, I want an Aqua Patch to it, actually. Yeah, we have another Floatstone, so you're going to bring up whatever you want so to be, So what's the better thing to put the Floatstone on? I actually think it's best to put on the Remoraid that we did that we just benched. Yeah, I agree. So I'm going to do that. Uh, I'm going to Floatstone here. I'm going to evolve the other Octillery. And Bird Boy, how do you clear your attacks when you play Mew with both Hotmons on the board? I have no idea. <laughs> you would just point at the one, I guess. And I think at that point you should just scoop. <laughs> uh, let's see, Octillery. I'm going to Abyssal Hand for four. We're looking for Ultra Ball and a Water. Not quite. God, this deck sucks. All right. <laughs> um, it was never supposed to go up against an Alola Nine Tails. <laughs> I could have played a non GX Gyarados, I guess. You should have. I I'm going to retreat have. back to the Jinx. To s I forgot to Victory Kiss. <laughs> Alright, and uh, there's nothing else I should play here, so I'm going to pass. <laughs> Alright, alright. <laughs> well. These are all cards I'm... Uh, uh, these are all cards of what? These are all cards I've used in, in various decks. <laughs> I want a regional. I want a regional with that jinx. <laughs> really? Yes. In expanded. Size me though? No. Uh, Verizian Genesect with jinx. From uh, a few years back, it was it was the year when you can change decks from standard to expanded. So a lot of the day one standard Verizian Genesex, they ran Jinx because to heal and it's good in Mirror because back then there was only Muscle Band and no Choice Band. No, Guzman, that's really mean. <laughs> no, no, no. I need that Octillery. Do we have any way to recover Octillery's? Mm, I generally don't remember. Good. <laughs> good. <laughs> This is gonna be great. Ooh. Like Jinx allows you to like you want your Gyarados to be damaged, but you also don't want it to be damaged um, yeah. too much. So Jinx helps you control the um, control the damage a little bit. Thanks, Pablo. <laughs> oh, good. There's two. Great. Deck out with Hug. That's... I don't think we can do that because well, I mean it could be a possibility. If Hug didn't do damage, then yeah, but because it does damage. I don't think it's possible. All right, let's go. Let's do this. Okay. Uh, we can't <laughs> use this to Aqua Patch. This is really sad. Um, so I'm actually going to make a play here to try to stall for a turn. Uh, my opponent only has two cards in hand. There's no way to draw. They play Guzma, so it's likely they have a draw supporter in hand, or else they wouldn't have gone so hard for that play. But I'm actually going to use Gyarados' GX attack and try to discard the double colorless energies as we get... Um, as oh, we... that won't work, buddy. Why? Oh, it prevents all effects of attacks? No, I thought it was just damage! <laughs> Get out of here! <laughs> what? Yeah, I think we should have been just attaching to the Talk to Larry. Oh, I, th I thought. I thought it was just damage. Well, this is this is good. <laughs> um, do I hold on for one more turn, then, to save the Aqua Patch? Uh, maybe. I mean... Well, I'm not doing anything anyway. Yeah. Uh, let me attach the choice band to Celebi. And now we have to figure out Celebi. a Pokemon to to discard. Yeah, I mean, I, I generally never... When I build this deck, I never expected to play against a Gyarados. So you know what? How about we do a redo really quickly? Like, let me just add a non-GX Gyarados, and we'll play against your appendage again. Okay. And then that should be more fun to watch, right? Yeah. And more do you fun wanna... to do. So... Your appendage, um, let's do that, right? So send me a challenge again, however, um, so we can get a good game in. However, let us add um, a Gyarados that can actually do something out of your deck, and so the match will be um, more fun. So, yeah, this is the deck. No, that was what do you more. mean more fun? That was, I think, <laughs> the peak amount of excitement that we can. Okay, so which Gyarados should <laughs> we use? This one? <laughs> what Bubble is that? Beam and Dragon Rage? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh, that's the same one. What does uh, this do? We can use this one. Burst Ten damage slash Pokemon. Uh, that's not terrible. Aqua Tail. That's better than the other one. We get to flip coins. I like to flip coins. Okay, I like to flip coins too. This series is actually 
Well, uh, we should we should make it three one, right? Just because. Nah, let's do it like this. So we can flip more so points. So we can flip more points, and we're gonna take out one jinx, or we're gonna add Victini. All right, there we go. There this we is go. now my type of deck. Now this is a hundred percent more fun. <laughs> exactly, Victini time. I so... just want to let the chat know there's zero percent chance I'm using the GX ever. <laughs> Let's go. So, I don't know challenge. That's RK. Serpent. Yeah, RK. There. there we go. Okay. So, let's go. Oops. <laughs> Extra click. There we go. Let's do this. Yeah. Oh, I, I realized my head was like over. My mouth was over, <laughs> like here. Bottom. Now I'm taller. Look. No, you're not. <laughs> well, I'm almost as tall. <laughs> I'm slouching a little bit. Little, 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 little. Uh, All right. Let's do this. I am beyond excited for clearly this. Clearly, I built for the wrong Gyarados. Clearly. You built the wrong Gyarados. Is... <laughs> uh, would I like to go first? Yes, I would like to go first. <laughs> that would be nice. Yeah. If you can, uh, it's cool to answer questions from the chat. Oh, I have not been... This, I'm a very... It's okay. Okay. But Our hand you've... sucks. <laughs> no, it doesn't. What do you mean it sucks? We got everything we need. We got the Gyarados. Um, Tiana Senpai, Bigabulu, it doesn't lose much in the rotation. It do, it loses Bridget, but it's not even using Bridget anymore. Yeah. So, it loses Sycamore and N, but everything else still seems okay. You have to click done. Ah. Everything else is still viable. <laughs> Rip Victini with no way to recover it. I mean, we have the Bloodstone, so we're hoping to get a good top deck. And then oh, beautiful! All the skill, all the skill. Beautiful. Sam Chen, ladies and gentlemen. Top all the deck. skill. <laughs> Top decks for days. Yeah, there's nothing else I can play, so we're just gonna end. You can field blower. Good, you got it. I mean, there was an argument to field blower, attach an energy, and then once you retreat, now you have an aqua patch target. That is, you're not wrong. Uh, <laughs> you're not wrong. I but, think we go for a magic orb, right? Yeah, I'm just figuring out what to discard here. We definitely don't discard the Gyarados. We definitely need the Cynthia. So the, those are the other three candidates. Guzma's not going to do us much good here. Um, and yeah, so now we can actually do something against the Knight. Yes, and I think I'm going to discard the Field Blower because I can use the Choice Band. Yeah. Um, all right. Magikarps, what do we prize? We have both of our non-GX Gyarados, so that is going to be amazing. Because <laughs> that, That's the only attacker I'm going to use. Um, aqua patches are important. Uh, where are the aqua patches? Wait, there's I'm three of them. Not using the interface. Yeah, there's three. Okay, so all aqua patches are there. Okay, so I'm gonna go go back and get a magic carp. Let's see, done. And that's all we can do. Wait, no, I have to play it down. Um, so do I retreat here? Uh, Tabu Fini can do 20 damage, but I do want to be able to potentially Aqua Patch to this Gyarados. Uh, I don't think Victini can be knocked out. Um, I'm not going to retreat. I'm just going to risk it. Whatever. Let's do it. Uh, yes, I am at Pablo's house. Uh, I'm here for the Mexico City special event. So... I will be playing the first tournament, or the first big tournament, I should say. It's not even big, but the first tournament in the new Forbidden Light format. Yeah. All right. So it's probably going to be two Alolan Vulpixes and... If they play Remoraid, if Sir Pandage plays Remoraid, then there'll be there'll be a Remoraid on the bench as well, I suppose. Oh no, it's gonna be Coco. Uh, well, I'm gonna have to try to find Mr. Mime. Uh, what type of programming do I do? So I don't. I I, I guess I code in R and Python, and I build some web interfaces. But I mostly do statistics. I work mostly in, uh, I build and validate statistical models for banks around the US. So that is, that is mostly what I do. 
Am I playing B-String? Uh, yeah, this deck runs four B-Strings, I'm pretty sure. I just... Gyarados is... Gyarados is menacing enough to be an Ultra Beast, right? Uh, so I'm going to Cynthia here. Don't want to give my opponent a new hand just yet. And, wow, what a bad hand. Okay, um... I can't actually let Victini die is a problem. Maybe I can. Maybe I can. Oh, thanks, thanks very much, Pedro. Um, let's see. I'm going to Brooklet Hill. What am I doing with my life, really? Uh, I do need to get an Octillery out at some point. Let's see. What's in my hand? Sycamore, Guzma. Uh, I, I might have to sack this Victini. No, don't do it. What am I supposed to do here? Uh, wait, what? Nothing changed. I was gone for a long time. No, no, no. He, he attacked me for 40 with the Aqua Ring. Um, I might have to sack Victini to keep Gyarados on the bench. No. All right. You know what, Pablo? I yeah. know. You got, like, Remory can take a hit. Right? That's, um, just don't want him to spread. I mean, should I, should I just go Gyarados? Uh, it does have the Berserker Splash attack. Yeah, I think that's it. Should I just attach going to Gyarados? Yeah. All right. Um, I don't want him to spread. Right, I can take one more spread before yeah. I need to all twelve for Mister Mime. I don't know if Mister Mime is prized because I'm an idiot. So I'm gonna <laughs> retreat uh, to Gyarados. This is sub so suboptimal. All right, we're done. We're done. <laughs> We're gonna get the DC and next. There's time. even synergy with um, Mr. Mime and Gyarados' first attack. It's just we planned everything, even though we improvised. Uh, I wanted to save the Ultra Ball, but maybe that was greedy. You're right. See, the chat is better at Pokemon than I am. So. <laughs> so we're good. <laughs> All right. And Sinister James, no, there's nothing specific you need to do to be added to the queue. Um, if you want to play, then I will add you. Sinister James. Okay. All right. Oh, no. <laughs> Is there a recovery? No. <laughs> hmm. I mean... All right, so my play changes, actually. Yeah. I'm going to Ultra Ball Scar on the Sycamore and Guzma just because we need to save the Gyarados. Yeah. Um, I'm going to have to grab the Mime at some point, but let me Brooklet first. This is the Mime? Uh, the Mime's in there. So I need to get the Mime this turn. Mm -hmm. I'm going to grab a Magikarp with the Brooklet, I think. Because mm -hmm. I don't need to hug this game. <laughs> Hopefully. Uh, Yeah, Omnipoke. I'm not sure there's going to be a stream this weekend. Uh, yeah, there's not. Yeah, there's no, there's no stream. So my play changes here. I'm going to Ultra Ball, discarding Sycamore and Guzma to get the Octillery. I'm going to have to Abyssal Hand for three, then Ultra Ball, discarding two of those cards <laughs> for, um, for... Hopefully I get an N here. No, I'm going to... Hopefully I get N in two bad... N Water Water would be my dream. So let me Abyssal Hand. Okay. Um, I'm going to Ultra Ball discarding Guzma and Jinx, I think, yeah. at this point. That's not terrible. Actually, there's no way for him to shut off my abilities except the Wobbuffet. And if he retreats the Wobbuffet, I'm actually fine. Ugh. I really would like the attack off this turn, too, though. Do I give up on... We have no way to recover, right? No Rescue Stretcher? Uh-uh. <laughs> yeah, Man, is... I'm here. I'm here. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna play a little greedily because why not? Discarding Jinx and Guzma. Around fifty Omnipoke. Around fifty to sixty players probably is a realistic amount. The new set is playable today, so it will be legal for tomorrow. All right. I really don't play. Ugh. I'm just so greedy because I want to use this Gyarados. This is obviously a mistake, <laughs> but we're gonna <laughs> we're gonna end our turn. <laughs> uh, these are such bad plays, but well, uh, I really just want to use 
this Gyarados. I know, me too. Yeah. <coughs> Maybe I should have taken out all the GXs and just put that one in. <laughs> you should have. Manchas, thank you so much for the bits. Very kind of you. Shuffle it in. Shuffle it in. Shuffle it in. Overtaking the White Snake. <laughs> no, 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 no. Not the Victini. No. Oh, this is car. Oh. Oh. Asshole. Oh, oh, we can't say that. I can't say that. I can't say that. I can't say that. He's gonna have to bleep this out for the video. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Pablo warned me not to curse on Sorry screen. about that, guys. Sorry. I'm so sorry. <laughs> oh, what? He's not killing it? You tweaked the lightning. Oh. <laughs> Darn. There you go. See, that's a. That's what I can say. Hello, Benjamin. Thank you so much for watching. Darn. I mean, we don't have to say no more, right? We, that's right. Um, so I'm going to send up the Floatstone Pokemon. This is convenient. Uh, so we can't have... You know what? I'm committed to this cause. Yeah. So I'm going to Brooklet first. Uh, get another Magikarp. So they're unkillable. <laughs> and I'm going to Abyssal Hand for into a DCE. Yep. Or an N. Into or an N. Or oh, both. Beautiful. Alright, so what does this do again? <laughs> <laughs> and Spam and Amazing. Rise, we don't know yet what Amazing. we're playing tomorrow. Uh, we're testing Gyarados, but it's <laughs> not really working out. Alright, I'm going to play the N right now. Yeah. Oh, sorry. Yes, it's not killing. It is knocking out. You're correct. <laughs> Welcome, Man of Faith. Um, Thanks so much for being here. Alright, let's see if there's no waters in there. You're welcome, Ooh. Julian. Uh, well, I'm going to retreat into this. I wish there was an Ultra Ball in this hand. The Victini Fun to is about to start, guys. Berserker Splash. <laughs> oh, that Mr. Mine is so clutch. Let's this, go. They're asking, is this your first time in Mexico City? Uh, oh, this is not my first time. I was actually here for the regional last year where I... Well, foolishly decided to play. Well, I foolishly listened to the advice of the rest of the American players here, who told me I was safe for top 16. And I foolishly decided to play Lycanroc GX with Raichu. Uh, this is when Skyfield was still in, in format and in standard. I actually started, uh, what did I start? 5 1? 5 1. No, no sorry, one, five, 5 1, one, but yeah. I finished 0 1 2 to miss, uh, to miss uh, top 32. So <laughs> that was unfortunate. And tell us about Greninja GX, Sam, and your experience with the deck. I'm 1 1 with it, is all I can say. <laughs> there was one really good game and one really bad game. Uh, so I do attach this floatstone here because we do need a thin. Yeah. Field blower sucks, but we have to deal with that. I'm going to attach a water to Magic Carp to get it ready. Yeah. Um, both of these can evolve, so I'm fine. Um, Floatstone will go on Octillery, because why not? And then I'm going to play an N. I know my opponent, it's a new hand, but we have to... Mm, this hand is a par. Does my opponent have any tools in play? Mm, nope. Is it worth it for me to try to... <laughs> I might just be the wrong Gyarados, honestly. <laughs> this is this is absolutely the wrong Gyarados. I can't risk that getting knocked out if all the Nine Tails is coming in. Yeah. I actually can't evolve. I'm gonna have to wait next turn and see what I get. Um, I could Abyssal Hand for three if I play Field Blower on the Brooklet, um, attach the Floatstone and evolve one of the Gyaradoses, but it's so risky because if I don't get it and there's a Guzma play, I'm just screwed. All right. I mean, we have the other Gyarados, so we can take a Bright Card and then we can just get the other Gyarados, right? I'm not saying we evolve. I'm just yeah, 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 yeah. I, I think we, I think we hold. Yeah, I think we hold. Yeah. And the, da the bench damage will start piling up. Yeah, quite a bit. That's true. All right, which two prizes? <laughs> this one, or there's only one prize. <laughs> that's unfortunate. Okay, that's DC a is a good card. card. <coughs> um, I might Sycamore next turn. Just go all in for that Gyarados. Okay, fair enough. Um, and just a god, what uh, the model list from you two? That's fair. Um, <laughs> Hello, Unreal Tarua. Thanks so much for being here. Um, so yeah, the queue right now only has Sinister James, who's a subscriber, and then there's Bird Boys, Platoon, and yourself. 
Um, but if more subscribers end up wanting to play, um, they will get preference, okay? And there's uh, four, three more games after this yeah. one that we'll play today. Um, hey, Unreal Zerua. And uh, to answer <laughs> Leo Rodriguez's question, I think yeah. the best two decks in the format, or the best decks in the format, will either play Buzzwall or Malamar. So let's say you have a cup. Well, there's no cups this weekend, are there? There's, if you have oh, a, yeah. let's say, yeah, let's say if you have like a tournament, a store tournament this weekend, and you want to play something, uh, play something standard or that's tier one in, in the new standard, I would go with something with Buzzwall or something with Malamar. There's two types of Malamars. Mm -hmm. There is the Malamar that uses pure psychic type energy that uses the Necrozma GX with Black Ray. Um, well, it doesn't really use Black Ray that often, but it uses the Dawn Wings Necrozma and the Necrozma GX. Uh, and there's a the other type with Metal Energy is an Ultra Necrozma. So you have some options. Uh, if you want to play something fun, uh, if you want to play something fun, well, the deck I've been testing a lot as Pablo is shaking his head is Zoroark Greninja GX. Uh, I ran, I run a, yeah, I run a 3-3-2 three, three, line of Greninja. Uh, GX and Greninja GX is actually quite helpful. Let's say your opponent has a Buzzwall with two fighting energies on it. Um, your Mewtwo EX can now kill with a DC each. Uh, sorry, your Mewtwo evolutions can kill uh, the the Buzzwall with a DC Choice Band Frog Deer. That's what I did to Pablo last night. Uh, <laughs> so it's fun, but definitely I wouldn't consider it tier one. And yeah, Sinister James, I love Zoro Ninja too. I have an unhealthy obsession. It's with fun. It's fun. It's just not tier one. I think. Yes. And, and just to go who's next on the list, it's Sinister James. Okay. Um, Beacon. Actually. Beacon is interesting. Yeah, Beacon is the best thing that could have happened to us. <laughs> yes, Beacon <laughs> is the best thing. Um, okay. So there's no bench space on my opponent's bench. A Guzma here would be amazing, but of course not. Uh, let's see. I'm okay with the late. He has a Lele and a. Vulpix. So he's going to bench the Lele for his supporter if he doesn't already have it. Which is fine, right? Which is perfectly fine. That means there's that nothing I, only one attacker. There's nothing really I need here. I might Sycamore this hand. Yeah, I think that's fine. Just get rid of his so. choice band. Touch here, yeah. I'm going to... I'm going to Field Blower. Do I need anything from Brooklet for my deck for the rest of the game? I don't think so. One Magic Harp is gone. I can't recover it. Yeah. The, the Remorade will be gone. So I'm going to... Discard this and Brooklet Hill, and the reason is there's no other tools, right? Yeah. Yep. And the reason I'm doing that is if I get another Brooklet Hill, I can play it down. Or something yeah. like that. I, uh, I mean, we do want to play that Garrows, right? Yeah, yeah. To here. Yeah. I'm so I'm so risky. This is obviously the wrong play. <laughs> um, but I'm going to. Uh, do I abyssal for one? Nah. If I get. get a null trouble. See. Got him. <laughs> Uh, Hello, Rhea. Thank you so much for being here. And they're asking about Zorogar. What do you think about Zorogar? Zor uh, so before I answer that question, one quick question, Pablo. Do I just pass here? No. Because my opponent didn't evolve. No, but he can retreat to that and kill. That's yeah. <laughs> it's okay. like. Yeah. <laughs> And if he knocks out this Gyarados, the Magic, the magic Arp survives, saves, yeah. I will find the Gyarados. If he and knocks the, out the Magic Arp, then the this Gyarados is survives. yeah, it's a 90. You're right, you're right. You're so good at this game, Pablo. <laughs> good. Sometimes. Good. How many Guzmas do we have left? I oh. discarded two earlier yeah. to that fancy Three. play. Ooh. Oh no, so we have, yeah, we have zero All left. Right. But we we will get the knockout on this little line tails next turn, assuming I hit a hit a Ultra Ball off this Cynthia. Yeah, oh. Zoro Garb, I think, uh, to answer the question earlier, Zoro Garb, I think, is the best version of Zoro Arc going into it, because going to the next set, because Garbodor shuts off Malamar, uh, Mar Malamar's ability. Zoroark hits weakness on Dawn Wings, Necrozma, uh, so it's easy to one-shot. And also, you have Trash Alange for Buzzwall, potentially. So there are... Definitely, definitely, I think it's the in, on paper it's the most well-rounded version. But uh, I played Pablo last night, and he played Zoro Garb, uh, something close to Gustavo's list. I got destroyed both yeah. times. Yeah, <laughs> or once, once, yeah. yeah. And L Frank nine five one, thank you so much for subscribing to uh, the channel. Appreciate it. You're bringing us closer to a new emote for the channel. 
and Shadow Lab as well. Thank you so much for the bits. That's very, very right. kind of you. All right, so very, we are out of magic. Maybe magic. I shouldn't evolve that Gyarados. Maybe. Maybe we shouldn't have evolved that Gyarados. I'm questioning a lot of my own life choices right now. I mean, no. We, we knock don't. this out. He gets Alola Nine Tails out, and we're screwed. Because yep. we have one. How many Guzmans do we play? Three. Uh, I'm not sure. I don't know. <laughs> I generally don't well, know. we've certainly misplayed our way into this one. Well, let's. I mean, we're gonna have to attack with artillery. We can. No. Can we? Do we we have don't have enough Guzmans left. We don't have I, the Remory's gone. So oh. this this is bad. We're gonna aqua patch to artillery just because <laughs> that is where we are in this game. Yep. I'll attach here. Right. Uh, attach the choice band here. Yeah. Why not? I'm gonna Cynthia and hope that my opponent doesn't have an Alola Nine Tails, the regular one. Next turn. Oh, good. Oh, we have another Guzma. That's good. Oh, that changes what I can do. I didn't realize that. Uh, well. We still take the knockout, right? Yeah, we obviously take the knockout. Yeah. And we're just hoping he doesn't have Floatstone, Aqua Patch, DC, knockout on this yeah. guy. If he doesn't, we are completely, completely fine. I think. Famous last words. <laughs> and. Which decks do we think are going to be tier 1 decks? Um, oh, I would very much like to get one more Berserker Splash off. Yeah. Because that puts me at two prizes, so Gyarados GX can take the last prize. <coughs> oh, no, this is not good. See? <laughs> Oopsie. Oopsies. Um, Eduardo, <coughs> uh, definitely Fighting Guys is going to be good. Definitely Malamar is going to be good. I think those two are unarguably tier 1. Yep. Um, Zorg with something will be very close to tier 1 or will be tier 1. Um, yeah, yeah, the inherent advantage Zoroark has over things like Malamar is just it's more consistent. Yeah. I mean, Malamar, Pablo and I played a couple games with Malamar last night, and it bricks, you know, a, a fifth of the time I would say Malamar can brick just yeah. early. And, and sometimes, like, yeah. you very specifically need a supporter, and you don't have space to mention Lele, or you just don't have the supporter. Mm -hmm. What do I think about Guardi with the new set? Uh, <coughs> Guardi is okay. Uh, well, that's bad. Shadow Lab, thank you so much. What? Whoa! He had exactly what we said we didn't want him to have. <laughs> I told you. Shadow Lab, thank you so much for the bits. Um, we are screwed. We are. No, we're not. What? No, we are. We are. We only have one Guzma left. If we had two yeah. Guzmas left, if we had two Guzmas, it would be fine. Yep, we lose. Thank you so much, Shadow Lab, for the extra bits. Well, Thank that you was so, unfortunate. So much. Well, there, are there any outs? What's left in the, our deck? Jinx is gone, so I can't even heal <sighs> twice. Um, yeah. Uh, yeah, our mistake was evolving that Gyarados. Well, we probably weren't gonna get yeah get there anyway. Um. Yikes. Yikes is correct. I mean, <laughs> I hug. I, you can't. I can't do we anything. Can, no. How many Guzmas have my opponent played? The twenty damage on the artillery is so relevant. Yeah. We need Jinx. Do we have Jinx? Jinx is in the discard because uh, we went for the Gyarados play and we evolved darn. stupidly. We needed Jinx. Well, this game is over. Yeah. Uh, deck out. Hope it's he has not no energy. Be possible. No, Fifteen. Well, check his energy count. He has one in play and three in the discard. Okay, never mind. <laughs> Um, uh, Gyarados GX sucks. We need the other Gyarados. Why did you even keep any of these in there? I wanted to do Shining Celebi flail stuff. Well, uh, I think there's nothing we can do. do you, should I scoot this game or do you want to yeah, play it? Yeah, I think it we're, we're going to concede, guys. We have no way to play around the Nine Tails. We could take one more prize card or two more yeah. uh, with Gyar powering up Gyarados GX and stuff, but. And I just realized, um, I didn't even put any stadiums in this. So we can't even do maximum damage. There was a, there's a, Brook, there's a Brooklyn Hill. Was oh, that yeah, ours? I played Brooklyn. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Okay, so I did so we're going to concede. I don't know okay. how to concede. Yeah, okay. So over here, GG's this. your appendage. Yeah. This was fun, right? That was fun. This was fun. Um, we're going to concede. Yeah. And now, uh, Sinister James is going to need a minute or so. Uh, we're just going to hang out. Heads uh, flipped to zero. That's so sad. Chat. That's so sad. <laughs> So yeah, thank you, thank you so much for the game. That was that was interesting. That was interesting. Um, <sighs> well, I, I guess uh, I guess what we learned from this, Pablo, is that we're not playing Gyarados tomorrow. Yeah, I guess uh, the valuable, the most valuable thing to 
get from this is indeed um, yeah good game sir do not play Gyarados GX do not play Gyarados GX play the shiny Gyarados that we were using that one's pretty good I didn't know that card existed until I then. did not know that either until right now <laughs> so alright okay so we're waiting for our next challenger who is Sinister James we're what gonna be enjoying more Gyarados right. action but I'll give you liberty to change the list as well. Oh God. All right. Let's do this. Um, <laughs> <coughs> I mean, the GX is obviously good. Yeah. We could play three and two if you wanted. I mean, no. I don't think they're going to be mean enough to use another safe card. Okay. <laughs> Hoopa. <laughs> they could be. This is Quad Hoopa now. <laughs> uh, I would like a Pokemon recovery card, I would say. There's three Brooklets. I mean, everything in here looks fine. It's just not a very good combination of cards. <laughs> uh, I don't think we need Victini, to be honest. I think we're just going to live and die by... Berserker Splash? Yeah. Fair enough. I would like a Rescue Stretcher. Yeah. Is, is the one card I missed. Because I think with Rescue Stretcher earlier in the game, we'd be able to make that Sycamore play yeah. much more. We even have uh, Tord in here. Mm. Thank you so much for being here, Tord. And... Is that Tord? Ooh. <laughs> What's up, Tord? Uh, okay. How do I add cards to a deck? Um, you okay. do this. Wait, what do I click? This? No. No. The here? Alright. And then there you type the <sighs> name of the All card. my party. <laughs> there, there. No, at the, at the shiny one. Oh, the sh Always at the shiniest card. What? It's what the public likes. <laughs> right, how do I save okay. this? Uh, on the save this. thing. The on the floppy disk. disk. <laughs> yeah, export deck. Save, save, save. Save. Yep. And yeah, all, all the top tier players here. <laughs> um, yeah, send us a challenge, Sinister James, and then right, we'll I get started right? with the Gyarados deck. Third place Memphis. You're still living in the past. What? I'm kidding. Uh, let's see. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. Um, except. So if, if we've missed a few things on chat, um, feel free to just uh, type them again. Just give me one second. Sure. Um, feel free to type them again if we didn't answer, and then. Between the game and stuff, we'll we'll try to get back to you, or we'll try to respond. <laughs> Wing bags. I'm going. Wing bags. Oh, that's so confusing. The yes is on the right. Yeah, it is so confusing, right? Why do they do that? Because they're experts at the programming of this thing. Oh boy, <laughs> this is gonna be fun. Well, we get to go first. I don't know what. Oh wait, is this Sir Pandage? No, this is a different person. Yeah, it's a Sinister James. Sinister James. All right. Well, I'm gonna start Magic Carp. Have we tried out the new Alolan Executor? I have the cards. I uh, have the cards as well. I just don't think it's very good. It has a maximum damage cap, and it's not 190. And even if it were, getting one. Yes! Alolan Golem! Let's go. We're weak, though. This is real bad. <laughs> I don't know how much damage it does. <laughs> is this gonna be my first North American regional win? Mm -hmm. um, <laughs> Very funny, uh, but yes, probably. Hmm. At least this season. Uh, well, actually, it's not even a regional, so... Yeah, it's not a regional, so... Uh, I'm gonna it doesn't discard count. this. My opponent has six cards. I don't want to bail them out if they have anything bad. But uh, Field Blower seems like it can go. We have three? Yeah. Two, we have two. Yeah. I think tomorrow has less prestige than the Indonesian regional, honestly. Yeah. I'm going to get Magic Card because I have the Aqua Patch. I'm just going to accelerate right now. Uh, no, he has never played PTCGO before. I have. I once streamed uh, a Ninjask deck out deck at Raymond Cipolletti's house when he used to stream. So, in your face, Pablo. I guess he's played twice in his life. I, I went through like the trainer challenges. <laughs> okay, we're going to attach this. Do I attach the DC, Pablo? What does this do? Can this knock out? Oh. He for sure plays DC, so tackle. Maybe we play it on the bench. No, it's so so risky to put it all together. Okay. Because we might need it later. Yeah. Yeah. But we do play four, and we don't need all four. Okay. You know what? We're uh, being risky here. We're being risky. I'm going <laughs> to live on the edge. Uh, I'm not going to fill my opponent at the event hand. And yes, Axel, there's a special event tomorrow in Mexico City. Brooklyn Hill. I'll use Brooklyn Hill. We're going to get a Remoraid and top deck and Octillery. <laughs> Indian Heaven, definitely table like our Flygon is not a good play in Expanded. And we oh, what a great hand we have. Yeah, amazing. <laughs> what do I think of Nagan uh, Naganadal Buzzwall? Is it Naga Naganadal or Naganadal? So the, sp the spirit being is called a Nega. 
So it's the know, what? The spirit being the, the like the etymology of the word. Nega is like needle in some language, and nega is uh is like a I don't I don't know what culture it comes from. I should read up on this, but it's like some spirit being. Okay. So. I just realized the enunciation was probably really bad there, but that's fine. Uh, or the pronunciation is really bad. Okay, so there's a Cynthia. We'll survive one turn. We get a Guzma kill, so that's that's something, Pablo. Yeah, good. Actually, do we even? Waterfall. Ooh. <coughs> I don't know what the golem does. I don't. I don't want to know what the golem does, so I'm just going to hope my opponent doesn't have it. Is it a lowland golem GX or non-GX? Obviously the GX. I think the non-GX would be even trickier. <laughs> yeah, that's true. <laughs> um, NATO is needle in German. But is it how is it pronounced? Nadel or needle? Russell is winning run up with Wigan. <laughs> Defense <laughs> curl. <laughs> Alright. Oh, did he flip head? Uh, he did flip heads, but we're gonna goose him here anyway. Okay. Ooh. Ooh, nah, which like one? <laughs> which one? Uh, actually, we uh, don't have Mr. Mime yet. Ah, uh, we don't have Mr. Mime yet. This gives so. up two prizes. Yeah, but he has nothing. <laughs> uh -huh. uh. Well, you said it, Pablo. If we lose this, I'm like, you don't want to knock out your own magic art, and you should Brooklyn as well. Sure, Pablo. <laughs> this pro plays. All right. What do I get? Carp or yeah. Remoraid? Carp, right? Alright. I'm just ready to knock out Remoraid and we're just screwed if we get an Ultra Ball. Um, You're not screwed, it just takes one more turn. Uh, do I do I knock out the Remoraid or the Flygon? I think the Remoraid. Yeah, the Remoraid. There's no Flygon in place. So or you can't knock that out. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'll take this. Um, do I attach? Evolve and attach, yeah. Well, it depends because I might want a draconic disaster <laughs> next yeah, turn. I guess, I guess we save the energy. Let's save the energy. This is yeah. such a bad. We don't want a dreadstorm. We definitely don't want a dreadstorm. All right, ultra ball. I think draconic disaster doesn't even one. Yes, kill. we're I'm so good. We're so good at Pokemon. No, it's a hundred. Oh, Lolan probably has like a thousand HP. Yeah, it we're definitely has so over good. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely target the remedy over the flagon. <laughs> Chad agrees with you. Let's go. With me, right? Let's go. <laughs> Octillery off the. Oh. Hello. Remory? Uh oh. <laughs> I told you you got the remory. I didn't say that. I didn't. I didn't actually tell him. I was just debating. Uh, I think that's just a, a stall play, though. No. I have no idea what he's Traveler gonna, does, but he, I don't think he's going to tackle with a belt. There's no way he can. Deal 60 damage without tackle with it. Look, continuous tumble. We're <laughs> done for. Uh oh. Six heads, Victini. No. Oh, okay, we're safe. We're safe. No, Fu Fury Belt. <coughs> Fury? What? Fury Belt. He's gonna not weak to lightning. We aren't. We aren't. Oh. Good. I read my cards totally. That's the card you played last weekend. I did not play that card last weekend. Yes, you did. I played Ion Pool. Oh, okay. Oh no! What does this do? <laughs> Thunder uh, punch! Oh in your boy! Face. Uh oh! That's scary. It is the GX, which we cannot knock out. Hammer <laughs> in, super electromagnetic tackle, and heavy rock GX. Your opponent can't play any cards from their hand. Oh, that's not good. All right, okay. so Bring my a turn. A little bit of a pickle here. Well, we evolved this and we try to Guzma out of it, right? Um, I want to try to kill that Graveler, but I can't. Do we kill the, the Remory? Do we hit the I Golem first? I think we first? have to hit the Golem. No, but he's going to get a second Golem. I'm going to hit the Golem because... What is love? Baby, don't hurt me. Don't hurt me no more. Um, definitely Guzma something. How do we construct our win condition? How we take... We take the Alolan Golem out. We probably have to knock out a second Alolan Golem, and then we can. He's probably going to electrode once or twice for us. So we might. We might only have to knock out one Golem. He's not going to electrode twice. We have to knock out one Golem, 
Oct like, okay. So we can... We could take out the Remorade again. I'm suspicious of that play, just because... It's either that or we have to... Well, he can't. He can Electrode. Out. You know what? I'm going to take the Remorade out. I think that's our <laughs> closest condition to victory, because if he ever gets Octillery out... <laughs> if he ever gets Octillery out, we're just done for. Yeah. And he... Oh, one Remorade already went down, so... So Z guys, I I tell uh, Sam, let's take the remedy out. No, we can't. And then not not even fifteen seconds later, yeah, let's take the remedy out. Yeah, it's usually how our Pokemon discussions uh, take place. All right, I'm gonna evolve, attach DCE to this Gyarados. Yeah, I mean we might have to. Use I this might want to use. This, uh, yeah. We're going to Abyssal it's Hand. All, yeah. for I almost said four, but it's three. Price penalty. Oh, good. <laughs> Look at that supporter we got. Um, well, DC is not bad. The yeah. Sycamore is bad. Um, do I attach the Floatstone? Sure. So I'm going to put it on the Remoraid. Not the Octillery, because I don't want to make the Octillery a more attractive target for potential Guzma. They're saying, if you lose this, you have to play Alolan Electrode tomorrow. Is there an Alolan Electrode? No, Alolan... Oh, Alolan. Alolan. Oh, that's cute. And With Electrode. That's not <laughs> Top deck Ultra Ball, and we're okay. Okay, three cards. By promoting that instead of the Close Stone, he obviously has the Electrode. Yep. Yeah. So we get a price card. It's going to be a Lele here coming out. Yeah. See, it's good that it's a Lele, not an Octillery. Although, we may, maybe we should have hit the goal. <laughs> oh, nice. <laughs> <laughs> the first thing I said. The first <laughs> thing I said. This is also how I think through plays at tournaments. <laughs> Not not even that far from the truth. <coughs> yep. Oh, please. Please, baby. Oh, baby. Yes. Yes. Sinister James, I love you. Don't know who you are, but you saved our aqua patches. It's, it's going to be dead cards. See? We got to worry. It's, that's actually quite good. We get to evolve the magic card. We get to Brooklyn Hill for the fourth magic card. Yeah. Uh, and then we get to the... See, we take a prize here. That actually makes it worse because our artillery is going to be weaker unless this is... Ah, there you go. N. <coughs> N's decent here, yeah. Oh, that's very cool how uh, when you attach the... It looks like, yeah, like, it looks like yeah. Ooh, heavy rock. <laughs> he whipped the knockout here. Oh, that's actually quite interesting. That's okay. I mean, it sets up the two-hit KO, right? Wait, yeah. what does the other attack do? Maybe we... Maybe he can never one shot the Gyarados. Hold on. I'll definitely get that. Are you confused, Sam? Oh no, it hits 200. Never mind. <laughs> we can never survive. I'm actually that. unsure why you didn't super electromagnetic attack all there. I mean. I mean, I Heavy know. Rock is good, but like he already has the second one out, so you get buzz out. Eh. Yeah. Well. Oh, he forgot about lightning weakness. <laughs> there we go. What GX am I using, though? What GX? What do you mean? What attack <laughs> am I one? using? Ah, uh, there's merit to the GX, right? Yes. Hello. Yep. maybe setting up the 2 KO was important, but... No, because this forces him to have to use the Electro now. Yeah. It forces him to, if he wants to... Oh, no, he can attack with the first attack! This is bad. I forgot about the first attack. <laughs> I should have waterfalled. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, guys. I forgot about. I I read the card and I just didn't see the first attack. What a mistake! Big mistake. That's all right. <coughs> we'll survive. <laughs> Another end. Okay, I can appreciate this one. I, mean, I need aqua patches now. This deal seems. Fine it seems fine. This is actually perfectly fine. I am. Thank you so much for the two bits. Appreciate it. We still have Guzmas left. We're going to be able to kill, uh, sorry, knock out the Voltorb or Electrode at some point. So enough the Rem Rate. This is fine. This is fine. This is fine. Yeah. This is fine. Oh, as long good. as we can do it, KO, it should be good. Yeah. Is there anything we can Brooklet for? No, right? No. We're out of tar Brooklet targets. <laughs> These plays make me feel better. This is actually good. <laughs> I, I feel bad when. Ooh. Ooh. 
I uh, imagine if we could have raged the previous turn. Or flailed, rather. What deck do we think is going to win the next world? There's a whole new set coming out before worlds, so it's really impossible to say right now that we're in right. May. Uh, I'm gonna Ultra Ball. We're never gonna use the. Do I need to protect myself? Does 110 make a huge difference at all? It could. Uh, that, that's already float stoned. You could choice ban hammer in. So I'm saying should I bench mine? And I'm gonna discard Celebi and then. Yep. For the other artillery. Sam Chen, best player. Well, that's far from the truth. <laughs> it's very far from the truth. I'll evolve this one. Yeah. Do, do I stretch her for anything? No. <coughs> I could stretch her for the Gyarados and evolve it, because we're not gonna we're not gonna use the other one anyway. Manchas, thank you so much for the bits. Appreciate it. Very, very kind. Come on. Yeah. It's gonna come down to finding the other <coughs> patches, which we should be able to. Well that's what I'm trying to do right now, yeah. Yeah. We have all three left. No, we have two left. Abyssal hand for four. Perfect. <laughs> Ideal, I would say. We're going you can to... still Abyssal hand for one more. No, I already, already Abyssal the first one. Ah, I got okay, double okay. Rooklet or something. Okay. All right, right. Okay. Um, do I float stone here? He probably doesn't run field blower. Or if he, well, he probably does. And... He probably runs two field blower. <laughs> None have been used, so I don't I don't attach a float stone here because in case there is a field blower, I want to be able to flexibility retreat. Axel, thank you so much for the bits. Berserker splash, let's go. And squeaks. Um, it's not regionals; it's just a special event, so it's only gonna be like 50 people. It's not that big a deal. Um, however, um, it should be pretty competitive because there are quite a few uh, of the top 16 players, like this guy. Um, over here, which is not something that's common for us, um, so I'm sure all the Mexicans will want to beat uh, the Gringos, and so uh, it should be fun. It should be a fun tournament, and then regionals next month. That will be pretty cool because that one will probably have between 300 and 400 players, maybe. So Two that should also be pretty cool. <laughs> yeah, 50 person TCG special event is a normal VGC regional, pretty much. Uh, the structure, it's the same. It's the same as a regional. Multi switch. Points. What is this sorcery? <laughs> it's the same. The same points um, as what a regional. What is this sorcery? And it's gonna be best of three rounds Swiss. It's just gonna be a smaller event. Um, is it best of three? I believe it's best of three, yeah. I think I read it was best of three. <coughs> okay, that's pretty scary, but... Did Aqua they play Patches? a supporter last turn? No. Uh, no. I think it's either means they have Guzman in hand, or they just don't have anything, so we're going to send it. It's going to be close. It's going to be close. Um, okay, so this is a start. Yeah. And Triton, these are Pokedex series. These are Pokedex um, Free prizes. We're trying to build decks with every single Pokemon in the Pokedex, and we're going in Pokedex order. So now it's Gyarados' turn. Play the Floatstone. Yeah. Um, and Squeaks, yes. Multi Switch can move Electrode because Electrode is a special energy. Do I Cynthia first or Abyssal Hand the first time? Um, I might Abyssal the first time because I'm not yeah. going to get to use two off after the Cynthia. What's the Aqua Patch? <laughs> That's okay. All right, I bet. The card we thin. What's the craziest deck that we're gonna see tomorrow? <coughs> Sam, what's the craziest deck we're gonna see tomorrow? Jeez, hold on. Let me figure this out <laughs> first. Uh, Jinx is seventy HP, so Hammer in kills it. I want him to try to use Super Electro Magnetic Tackle. I could try to thin for the Aqua. Okay, so let me think. Yeah, do I get the Aqua Patch here? Yes. So we could discard this and this. We could try to get the Aqua Patch because we need both Aqua Patches. We could also force him to hit himself, but Wait. if he has Guzma, it's just real bad. Both Aqua Patches? We have. We need to hit one this turn, one next turn. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. At some point, we need both Aqua Patches. So I'm gonna Ultra Ball, discarding. Um, yes, Forbidden Light is legal next. Um... For this event, it's legal today, so tomorrow we are playing Forbidden Light decks. Um, 
the craziest thing. I mean, if I see an Alola and Executor deck, I'll be very surprised. <sighs> what do I discard here? And Two waters? No, I might want to end him next turn if he puts, puts me down to one. So I have energy. Okay, then the floatstone. Yeah. yeah. Um, and thank you, Man of Faith. Um, the Pokedex, it's something I've been working on for a while. Um, and there's a whole playlist with a lot of different decks, starting all the way from uh, Bulbasaur, Ivysaur, Venusaur, now all the way up to Gyarados. So, Aqua Patch, please, yes. <laughs> please, thank you. Malamar with Clefairy, maybe. I mean, Clefairy is pretty decent um, for the mirror. I feel like Mimikyu is better than uh, Clefairy. Um, Do I Ultra Ball again? Yeah, he's not gonna. He's not gonna end me next turn. So yeah, there's a lot of um, hundred waterfall. There's a lot <coughs> of potentially cool decks going around. Uh, you just lost to Zorak, Alola, and Executor, and PTCGO. How what? much damage can Alola and Executor? I do? think it's capped at one twenty. Uh, oh Was yeah, it? it's capped at one twenty. Yeah. So and grass typing isn't that big of a deal right now. I mean, it's good against Lycanroc, Rock, but. I mean, it, that deck could, if you play like Mewtwo and stuff, I don't know, it's, it's too much. I don't know, maybe it's good. I think if you're playing in an event tomorrow, fuck. You would want to play something safe. You want to play right? something safe, because tomorrow, if you're playing in the Mexico special event, um, you want to play, uh, you want to play, you want to get top 16, right? There's no prize money for winning, and I think for every American that's going to be here, it's there's no huge difference between getting 80 points and getting 200 points. Just locking up, um, trying to lock up top 16. So most players here are trying to lock up top 16. So I think if you're playing tomorrow, do that. If you want to play something fun, man, Zoro Ninja is my <laughs> Zoro Ninja is Ninja is fun, yeah, definitely fun. Yeah, um, Smasher, uh, Smasher, we can we can use new cards. Yeah. Today is the first le uh, legal day for the for the for Forbidden Light. Yep, and trainers do know <coughs> we're playing in a special event in Mexico City tomorrow. Special event in Mexico City, so it gives the same points as regionals. However, um, it's um, <clears throat> it doesn't offer the prize money. Is DCE in deck? Or is it prized? I should have checked. I have no clue. Um, opinions on Gardevoir with how big Metal Beast Box is? I don't think Gardevoir is good. The format is just too fast for it. Gardevoir stopped being good when Buzzle started being good. And Buzzle now just got even better. <laughs> which means, which must mean Gardevoir is now Guzmas worse. are left? Well, what's in my discard pile? I have two Guzmas left. And we know we play four. We know we play four. I have one DC left. I don't even know if it's in the deck. We can check. We can check. Yeah. And if it's then, prized, we are in trouble. Uh, if it's prized, we lose. And it's... Moment of truth. Prized. Yep. That... We have no attacker, right? Uh... We are done for. We are, yeah. Well, do we concede here? We have no attacker left, have guys. No attacker here. So, GG, Sinister James. We have no attackers left. Um, playing three Aqua Patch also seems bad. We, uh, this we'll one was this close, game. though. This one like, was close. If, if we got rid of that Golem, we probably win, right? Yeah. Yes. He, he can't use Electrode anymore. So, GG, Sinister James. GG. Good games. And yes, Manchester in Cancun, we should expect points from top 32 and upwards, as long as the 100 plus people that have registered do show up. How many people are registered in Cancun? I believe last count was like 112 really? masters. Really? Okay. Yeah. So. Wow, that's actually quite high. Yeah. And not not as many Americans will be there because some Americans are going to be going to, to uh, Roanoke, Roanoke to chase the regionals' yeah. wins and prize money. Okay. Your so, deck was quiet money, although I don't <laughs> appreciate the weakness of these know, that we right? have there. It's but uh, it felt like we were always going upstream against Alola, Ninetales, Nun GX, and then uh, the weakness. But that's what this series is about—just enjoying, having fun. It creates some quirky scenarios. Yeah. And now we are moving on to Lapra. So if there's any subscriber that would like to play against me and or Sam, yes, um, unless you wanna go to work and stuff that eh. you wanted to do <laughs> eh. um we can we can play otherwise it's bird boy's turn uh to play and we're using a lapras which as you guys must have seen on omnipoke's channel or my channel as well uh lapras gx apparently has potential as a as a tier maybe tier one deck probably tier two however 
we made some adjustments to the list, right? To make it less unfair, right? Mm -hmm. So it should prove to be very fun. And the deck has a total of six Lapras, I believe, six or seven. So <laughs> it should be pretty fun. Um, wow, I totally threw that game with that with that uh, GX attack. That was yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's okay.